We're really excited that the first SK-1300 in Australia has been sold to Liberty Industrial. Uh, they're very excited that the first SK-1300 is, is, is theirs as well. We're very fortunate to get an order uh, at a sale to Liberty Industrial, uh, who's a big player in the Australian demolition market. Um, they've got uh, a long-term project for it in Gove, uh, Northern Territory, so uh, they've got a few years' work ahead of it. And um, we started talking to Liberty Industrial, um, oh, we've, we've talked to them for a long time, but we, we started talking seriously about the SK-1300 uh, about 18 months ago, um, and they were one of the first globally to order one. About a year ago, uh, we were uh, demonstrating our first machine at our dealer in the Netherlands, and Liberty Industrial, they, they took the opportunity to visit us and to uh, go and see the machine and to check the uh, ease of transport and the ease of assembly and to feel the hydraulic uh, performance. So that was, they were very pleased with what they saw and uh, so after, after the demonstration, they ordered the machine with our uh, colleagues in Australia. They, they were quite excited by the capability of the machine. The, again, the 40 meter reach with a 4.3 ton tool was very appealing and it, it stacked up very well versus other, other options in the market. They quite liked the versatility of buying all, this, all the separate booms with it. So in particular, the separate boom or the, the main, the largest boom that comes with it has a capability of carrying a 12 ton tool. Uh, at ground level for processing, so it's going to be a very productive machine once the material's on the ground for, for disassembly. The SK-1300 will be coming with every uh, boom segment available, so it'll be uh, everything from the 40 meter configuration uh, in the, the three-piece boom design to the two-piece uh, boom design that has a maximum reach of 35 meters or 31 meters depending on the configuration and then they're buying a separate boom with an insert, which gives them capability of uh, running a 12-ton tool at ground level or 9.6-ton at, at reach with that separate boom. So they're getting all the different configurations, uh, which will suit them for different stages of the project. The nice thing about Cabelco and the SK-1300 is it gives that high reach capability, 40-meter capability with a 4.3-ton tool uh, direct from the OEM. So it's, it's, it's a turnkey solution that is um, very capable and previously it wasn't capable without customizing it on site so I think that really appealed to Liberty and it was one of the reasons they decided to buy the SK-1300. OEM support and a lot of capability. It is definitely uh, a remote location no doubt about it. To put it in perspective the biggest city uh, in Northern Territory is Darwin. If you look at Google Maps and ask how to get there by car it's a 23 hour drive you would have noticed which means there's no major roads that go to go uh, from Darwin. So all, all of the equipment for that project is actually going to be um, shipped there by a barge from Darwin around the top of Australia and then into, into go for the project. So yeah, it is a challenge, but no doubt about it, we're, we're committed to supporting it regardless of where it is. It sort of goes with the territory in Australia. Um, it's just one of the challenges of, of a business in Australia in general is that it's, uh, it's quite a big country with a relatively small population that's very spread out. So um, we're not new to supporting remote places in Australia. It's, it's we'll par for the course. We'll have uh, certainly a combination to have uh, fast moving parts, consumables, uh, filters, things like that on site so that they don't have to have any downtime uh, or, or waiting for shit in it. But our dealer will also have a recommended parts stocking list at Darwin and we've got the capability uh, out of our main shipping, out of our main parts distribution warehouse in Sydney uh, to get parts overnighted to just about anywhere in Australia. I'd say Go will probably be a two day turnaround for, for parts, but we've made a commitment to back that machine up with the SK1300. It shares um, common components with uh, in, in the drive line with our 85 ton SK850. So. We've actually made a pretty strong parts commitment to keep all the major components in stock in Australia for both machines. It's uh, certainly something that we wouldn't be selling if we didn't have the capability and the commitment to backing it up, and that's what we're doing. It's the first machine to be delivered into Australia. Uh, so being that it's our first machine, we, we have uh, quite a bit of support coming straight from Japan to help us not only uh, put, the, put together the machine for the first time and, uh, and learn the proper way to assemble and disassemble the machine, 
Liberty will be involved uh, in that process as well so that their team can learn how to uh, properly assemble and disassemble the products. Uh, but we'll be doing comprehensive training on, on operation and, uh, and assembly transport, that sort of thing. Straight from the factory in Japan, they'll be coming to Darwin for a few days to support that handover process with Liberty Industrial Yen. All the Cabelco heavy excavators, uh, including the SK-1300, have a standard uh, system on board. It's called Geoscan or Comexis. Um, that, that is a, a, a telematic system that gives you comprehensive capability to, to monitor the condition of the machine. Uh, certainly notifies you of all the upcoming services. Any uh, sort of yeah, potential fault codes or anything is going to be uh, accessible via that, that system as well. So you do get complete access to all the sensors and the computers and the telematics uh, on that machine. So really, um, the system gives our dealers and, and Cabelco the capability to sort of know if there's any issues or problems before the customer even does. It also allows us to proactively schedule uh, all the servicing, um, all, all the scheduled maintenance needs of that product. We'll, we'll be able to work directly with them, knowing when they're approaching all the service intervals and, uh, and getting them what they need before, before they even know they need it. Yeah. We're really excited that the first SK-1300 in Australia has been sold to Liberty Industrial. Uh, they're very excited that the first SK-1300 is, is, is theirs as well. Um, you know, they've, they've looked at Cabelcos for a long time. Uh, the visibility that the SK-1300 has had in the global demolition market, I think, is, uh, is exciting not only for Cabelco, but also for Liberty Industrial. And, and yeah, I think they're, uh, they're innovators um, in their space. Uh, they're innovators in Australia and uh, in, the, in the industry. And uh, yeah, we're really, we're really proud to have an SK-1300 sold to them, for sure.